Hey everyone, today I'll show you how to set up the J-Panel connection for your PC case's front panel buttons and make it work with any motherboard, specifically the MSI B650 Tomahawk. Let's get started. First, locate the J-Panel header on your motherboard. On the B650 Tomahawk, it's right here at the bottom right corner, clearly labeled as JFP1. If you're using a different board, check your manual as the location may vary. Next, let's identify the connectors from your PC case. Typically, you'll have connectors for the power button, reset button, HDD LED, and power LED. They're usually labeled like this. Now here's the key. If you have your motherboard manual, refer to it to match the positive and negative pins, or just follow along in this video. For the LEDs, they have separate positive and negative nice pins. If you're unsure about the orientation, the printed arrow on the connector usually indicates the positive pin. Plug these in carefully and double check to avoid mistakes. You can clearly see the positive pin here on the board. And for the power switch and reset switch, polarity doesn't matter. Let's start with the power LED. Connect it here. Next, plug in the power switch right next to it. Now, connect the HDD LED. And finally, the reset switch. Once everything is connected, power up your PC and test the buttons. If everything works as expected, congratulations! You've successfully set up your J-Panel connection. And there you have it. A quick and easy guide to setting up the J-Panel for any motherboard using the MSI B650 Tomahawk as an example. If you found this helpful, give this video a thumbs up and subscribe for more tech tips. See you in the next one.